everybody and welcome to another Monday plan with me. This week I am going to be planning from October the 1st to the 7th. The kit I am using is school and Schools and Bows from Your World of Colour. I have the full box sheet, uh, half boxes and some functional stickers. Glitter headers because I asked for them to be changed to glitter headers instead of words and little things. And then your bottom washi and date covers. I've already halved my washi, that's why it's split. It didn't come like that. Um, I also have this gold foiled Halloween washi to go with it. Um, I'm going to try and do a little bit of a talk through as I'm placing the kit down just to try and make these a little bit longer so I am going to start by writing everything out that I usually do so I just usually write out the bottom bit of the dates because of how big they are um, don't think we have much going on this week. I mean, the girls do have their after-school clubs that they usually go to. Um, they both have one on a Tuesday. And then my eldest has Nucleo on a Thursday. If you're new to my channel, Nucleo is the after school orchestra that my daughter plays violin for. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with the washi yet, but I'm going to do washi date covers and then some more washi and my gold foiled washi as well so when I can peel it off the paper I think I'll place this one down here I just decided to fold the corner am I in frame? I think so so last week kind of went as planned um thought I would talk to you about what I am planning on doing this month if you don't follow me on Instagram um, my Instagram is linked down below but I did share um, a picture over on there saying that this month I'm calling it October Spooktacular. Thank you to Beth who is on the Your World of Colour PR team with me for helping me come up with a name but um, I'm just calling it October Spooktacular. thought just to change it up a bit for the month with it being Halloween month. Um, all the kits I am using this month are from your world of colour she just had so many to choose from i just couldn't choose one so i decided i'll do the whole month with your world of colour kits so that is my plan for this month One second, just so I can concentrate to make sure this goes down straight. But um, that is what I plan to do this month. Um, let me know in the comments if you like the little thing that I did on the introduction to this video. Thought I'd add 
a little something. Um, I don't know whether to add some gold foil to date covers. I don't even know if I have, I do have gold foil like date dots, but I'm not sure if I have the right numbers or not. So <clears throat> we will have to see there. But I don't think I've cut this bottom washi tight quite right. Let's turn over to the other side. Um, do you have any plans for this month? Um, have you got little ones that you take trick-or-treating? Mine are a little bit older now and not many people around here open their doors to trick-or-treaters. My boy Tats decided not to cooperate again. Um, so we just, last year, I did like a picnic tea in the house and decorated the house for them and they quite enjoyed that so I think I'm just going to do that again. So not much plans for Halloween but we do do bonfire night so looking forward to that. Um, hopefully got some good stuff to show you in my haul videos this time as I've placed quite a few international ones for this month as I loved the Halloween and the the ones for all the end of the year like your Halloween and your Christmas and some autumn ones as well so they should start arriving soon so I hope that will make my haul videos a bit better I think I'm just going to cut this washi down and then speed through the rest for you because I'm not quite sure where I'm placing my boxes yet but and I hope the volume is good on this I have had a few problems because obviously I film on my phone I have a few problems with volume because so obviously I can't turn the volume up but um, I'm going to speed through the rest of this and get back to you when I place my functional Is all my kit placed down 
I'm going to use a habit tracker with an Edna sticker from Willa Wallaco to mark reading for the girls. Um, I'm going to change it up a bit this week. I'm just going to place the stickers down and then do the writing off camera and come back. So for Monday I use a half box with a Coffee Monsters Co. Autumn MOT to mark Coffee Monday. I then use a red planner from Handcrafted by Sherry to mark that I want to share my weekly spread along with this foiled heart sticker to mark that I need to film. These are just from a normal sticker pack you can get from a stationery shop. I then use another half box with this um, cauldron sticker from a Harriet Wright Designs deco sheet to mark that I want to prep tea. I then use one of my filming emoji, uh, filming puppets from Laura Jane Styles to mark my plan when we will be up, and then this unicorn from my friend Mochi to mark YouTube binge. For Tuesday, I use this autumn shopping girl, which I just cut down a bit to mark that I will be meeting my mum. Then underneath this I wanted a checklist just to mark some main things that I wanted to get while I was out. So I cut a checklist box down to four hearts and put this underneath. Most of the foiled stickers I will be using will be just from a normal sticker pack. Then I use another half box from the kit with a foiled bow sticker to mark that my youngest has after school film club. Followed by a foiled star sticker to mark that my eldest has after school homework club. Moving on to Wednesday, I use a quarter box from the kit along with a sticker from the Petite Paula. This is from one of her Halloween sheets just to mark that I want to get some laundry done. And then I use another box, I think these are appointment boxes from the kit along with another one of those foiled hearts to mark that I need to edit. <coughs> I then leave a space in case anything comes up and then place a half box with a laptop sticker from Your World of Colour to mark that I want to do some blog work. And then lastly, I use this pumpkin basket from a deco sheet with a foiled shopping script from Planning by Miss Eve. Moving on to Thursday, I use a post-it note sticker with money stickers on top from Sprouted Paper Co. to mark that it is payday. I then use a strip of washi from the kit along with the buy all the stickers sticker from your world of colour to mark that I want to do some Etsy purchases followed by a Facebook sticker from Peaceful Mind Design to mark that I want to do some promoting for Diamond Prince Designs. At the bottom I use a quarter box from the kit along with a, another one of those foiled bow stickers 
to market I need to film next week's plan with me I then use another foiled star to mark that my eldest has nucleo after school and then lastly I use another one of those appointment labels with a unicorn sitting at a desk to mark that this is when my youngest's homework needs to be handed in. Moving on to Friday I use a half box with this foiled circle sticker with a skull on just to mark anything that comes up. I then use a Instagram character sticker from Stationery Heaven Co to mark that I want to share what kit I will be using for next week along with a half box and a foiled crown sticker to mark that I need to edit my plan with me. I then use a bin sticker from Your World of Colour to mark that it is recycling day and lastly a YouTube puppet to mark that I have a Your World of Colour haul going up. Moving on to the weekend, Saturday I use a teardrop sticker with a foiled music note to mark that I need to do the voiceover for my plan with me and then a the petite Paula twin or friend sticker to mark that we will be seeing my mum at the bottom I use a half box with a character sticker to mark that it is movie night and then a nail polish sticker from your world of colour to mark that I want to paint my nails. <coughs> Moving on to Sunday, I use the hibernate stickers from Once More With Love to mark sleep in. I then have my four heart checklist. This is just cut down from a six heart checklist just to mark all the things I need to get ready. For Monday with it being school day. I then use another one of those the Petite Paula Halloween stickers to mark laundry and another teardrop from the kit with a 15 frill character sticker to mark early night. I then remembered that I need forgot to put my food tracker sticker from the pump planner in so I stick that at the bottom of Thursday but that is all my plans for this week I'm going to write everything in and then I will get back to you This is my spread or finish. I think it turned out really well. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, please do so and give this video a thumbs up. Uh, leave me a comment if you wish and I shall see you in my next one.